Kickoff just under 45 minutes away. And joining us tonight, Rio Ferdinand, Stephen Gerrard and Richard Dunn. And uh, Rio and Richard, I know you've been out there today. You've been here all day doing... Yeah. doing... <laughs> starts up front it's seven changes from Huddersfield at the weekend it's a very very attacking lineup selected tonight by Pep Cower all into double figures for goals this season Falcao has 22 so far just Pep Guardiola and uh, Leonardo Jardim and the officials here tonight all from Spain so off we go a tough task on Torre and now Raheem Sterling and out comes the goalkeeper and the flag went up against Raheem Sterling, but it's encouraging for City there, Steve, the way they were able to interchange yeah. the ball around the box. It's a nice ball by Kevin De Bruyne. Here's Lamar. With a good eye for goal, that's full-back Mendy, who's arrived in a hurry. And Caballero down, Falcao onto the loose ball. It's offside, yes. and the offside. Sterling is offside. Yeah. Torre got a touch on it, which just took it away from uh, Glick, who was coming in at the far post. In, in first time by De Bruyne towards Aguero, and then agonisingly in front of David Silva. His ability on the ball, and now David Silva. Sane carried on running, and he's onside, and he can tee up Raheem Sterling for the first goal of the game, and a great way to start for Manchester City. Brilliant by Lilo Sane. Sadibe gets a yellow card. The first thing to do is attack him. Lilo Sane gets at him. Beat Arsene Wenger's Monaco in the mid 90s. Outside. Bato this time. The ball from the ball away. Fabinho in towards Falcao, and that's what he does. The poacher extraordinaire with a goal for Monaco, and who else but Radamel Falcao? I'm sorry, the goalkeeper now to Fletch. No mistakes on big nights like this, no mistakes. Miss it clearance from the goalkeeper. Oh. So it was the faintest of touches as well, wasn't it? Here's Monaco at the other end. And it was Mbappe, not for the first time, in that inside left channel, causing a problem. One ball, look at this. Kevin De Bruyne, Aguero's on the move, and Aguero's in, and the goalkeeper's caught him. Now he's given the other card to Aguero for diving. Yes, he has. Well, the whole stadium held its breath as the Spanish referee came running in. Let's don't make a challenge on certain nights. The calls again. Here's Mbappe, who's in behind them, and Mbappe can fire Monaco ahead. And everything we heard about this free-scoring Monaco team is coming to fruition in Manchester. Yeah, it was a great finish. Let's, but let's be honest. If a group of under 15 defended like that, a straight ball from a free kick, we'd be berating them. This is arguably one of our best teams. Look at this. By Falcao. Falcao! Just slightly off target, but look how quickly they go from defending. Well, there's the half-time whistle, and food for thought for Pep Guardiola. Play at the moment in the second leg in three weeks' time, and if it is like this in three weeks, Steve, they will need every attacking player they can find, including Mendy. And Mendy with another good ball in towards Falcao, who didn't quite get enough on it. He got away with murder there, Otto Mendy. Got away with murder. In the Champions League. And Caballero saves it, Falcao misses again, and that is a lifeline for Manchester City. Yeah, and just this was just this is skip away from Bakayoko, and then Bakayoko's caught him. And the referee reaches for another yellow card this time. Free kick. Which is taken by Kevin De Bruyne. And it was begging for a touch. The flag was up anyway. 
They can set off the other way now for Manchester City and feed Aguero. Aguero! Oh, what a mistake by the goalkeeper! And what a way for Manchester City to get back in the game! Shocking goalkeeping by Subasic. And Sergio Aguero with a goal for Manchester City. Goal for City, shot by number Yeah, he's back on the score. He's back on the score sheet. Raheem Sterling does really well. Fix the pocket there. This is where the problem was in the first half. Stones has done better initially. Oh. No, he's lost it. Oh. And Falcao's in. Oh. oh, look at that. That is brilliant from Radamel Falcao. But John Stones will hold his head. It's another Manchester City defensive howler. But the brilliance of the finish cannot be underestimated from Radamel Falcao. What a goal by Falcao. Audacity, courage. Look where this stems from. Nice the city breaking for. Still Mbappe. It's like you attack, we attack. In by David Silva. Aimed towards John Stones and then whacked in by Sergio Aguero. Brilliant finish. Anything Falcao can do, Aguero can for Manchester City. Yeah, he was slightly forced in with his first goal, but everything about that second was class. Long ball from the corner, evaded everybody. By Kevin De Bruyne, it's a good corner, and Manchester City are in front, and it's John Stones, the man responsible for Falcao's second goal, has scored one on the other end for Manchester City. There's Willy Caldiero at all for this mistake. The big Johnny Stones has gone and done exactly the same. You cannot write this stuff tonight. City away with a speedy Leroy Sane. Fabinho's fouled him. Yeah, it was. It was a left arm right across. Aguero to David Silva. Aguero's made the run and he's in behind them and he tees up Leroy Sane! The goal. But Manchester City have got another one! And they've come from behind and now lead 5-3 on this amazing Champions League night in the Etihad. Well, I think the boys are going to have to stay till half 12 in that studio going through this game. Go Certainly Rio and Dunny, because defensively... Mon and it goes towards oh, Falcao, oh. brilliant save by Caballero. Oh, my word. Just when you think it's all finished. Okay. Well, the final whistle to bring to an end a simply fabulous Champions League match here at the Etihad, and those two will do it all again in three weeks' time. After the shootout at the Etihad, the blowout at the Emirates, and here's Mbappe, and Mbappe's in! Willy Caballero, danger for City again, really good block by Stones, and then drilled in, and it's gone in, and they've got the early goal! And it's exactly what Monaco wanted, Kylian Mbappe's claiming it, and they are back in the tie, well and true. to Mbappe is offside. It was close. It was close. But the arms went off in the match this, this time. And then the shot was driven in. First shot. Now Mendy. This is one in. ran right over to the left back. What a ball this was. Caballero came and got a good punch on that. It was uh, Jemison, the centre back, who was putting him under pressure. First goal, which got them back in it. And then Fabinho with his tenth goal of the match in the hands of these Monaco players. Clinton here towards David Silva. And uh, Subasic having to get involved. For the first time, really, in the match, he was just caught there by David Team De Bruyne. Good run here by Sterling. Can he tee up somebody? Raheem Sterling, Sergio Aguero couldn't get there. Raggy with a vital challenge. 
It just took too long, Manchester City. He didn't hit the pass. Sade might be the man to do it. Sade's in behind! What an opportunity! Chances that are usually gobbled up by Sergio Aguero. Yes, they've got defending to do here. David Silva. Still David Silva. Now Sergio Aguero! This is the moment, and that's the save. Subasic with a huge save for Monaco. Great save by Subasic. Wonderful play by Dan. Leroy Sane in behind them again. The goalkeeper came out this time, and Sane, with Aguero and Sterling waiting in the middle, went for it himself. Yeah, he was neither here nor there, was he? He didn't know where to shoot. Sterling still. Leroy Sane! There's the goal that Manchester City desperately wanted, and it's provided by Leroy Sane to throw to the Champions League lifeline. And yeah, it's totally deserved. Manchester City played really well in the second half. They've attacked. Hansen De Bruyne in on Fabinho. Fabinho to come and get it if he can. Teased in by Lamar! And there's the goal for Bakayoko! And just like that, the tie swings round again. Monaco back in control of it. And Bakayoko with a big goal. Talk about goals coming from nothing, though. Really high line from Manchester City. Huge area, huge area to put it in. Cross. Fernandinho, Sane, the look at the watch. The referee blows the full-time whistle, and Manchester City are out of the Champions League. The celebrations begin for Monaco. One of their